Hi. <coughs> Sorry. Hi, I'm Ashley from Bookaholics Anonymous, and this is In My Mailbox, hosted by Christy of The Story Siren. So, let me get started. I'm sorry if I get a little movie. I got three dogs like in my lap. I got Ren, so my friend's friend's dog. I got the little devil Miko again, the sweetheart. And then I have my Toby, which is right here. So if I seem a little distracted, that's why they're all in my lap. But um, I got some stuff from some different places this week. Um, the first ones are from Amazon, or no, the first one I borrowed from my friend. She doesn't know I borrowed it because I'm staying with her, but I did. It's Water for Elephants by Sarah Gruen, I guess. Yeah. So yeah, I borrowed that. Dogs, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, the next ones I got from Amazon. So here they are. I'm excited. I got matched. Um, so I'm hoping this will like help me with the dystopian because, <laughs> you know, yeah restore my faith in those kind of books. So yeah, um, it's by Ali Condi. I just got these today. Yay, I got that one. Um, the next one, or the next two are by the same author, uh, Amanda Hawking. The first book is My, Bro my Blood Approves. I read it as an e-read, so I've already done it, and I already did a review on it. The next two are, um, crap, I don't remember which way they go. Uh, well, anyways, uh, the first, it's Flutter. I don't remember which is the, the second one, which is the third. And the next one is Fate. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, the first one was pretty good. It's kind of like the Twilight, it's kind of Twilighty, but it was still pretty good. It's a vampire book if you didn't notice. I gotta order the first one. It's a blue cover. Um, the next one I forgot, I can't talk. I forgot I had ordered. I guess it was on back order, or it, was, or it just came out, I don't remember. But it's uh, Safi, oh, I don't even know how to say it, by Catherine Fisher. It's the sequel to Incarceron. I've got my dog laying in my lap now. So yeah, I got that one. It was a shock to get that one. I had like three boxes in my office. People are like, wow, it's pretty cool. Um, the next ones I got from Half, Pri Half Price Books. I got uh, TTYL. By Lauren Miracle. It's um, I've seen it on a couple of people's blogs. It's kind of like written in I am stuff. It's kind of com computery. I thought it was kind of cute. So hopefully I'll like it. It's about three best friends. So yeah, you can't beat like a two dollar book. I mean, come on. But yeah, I got that one. Um, the next one I got is Vacations from Hell. It has a um, Sorry, my phone's dead. It has Libby Bray, Cassandra Clare, Claudia Gray, Maureen Johnson, and Sarah Milanowski. Milanowski. And they wrote in it. Um, I have the other two. I have two others, actually. I have uh, Prom Nights from Hell, which I haven't read yet. I need to. And then I have uh, Kisses from Hell, which I did read, and I reviewed it already. So if you want to know about it, go to my thingy. Somewhere in there. But yeah, so I have this one. I think I need one more. Like, Love is, Love is Hell or something. So yeah, I'll be looking for that one. Um, sorry. The next one I have is Ruined by Paula Morris. My, it's quiet. My dogs went off somewhere. It's like a ghost story. It's really cool looking. I like the cover. The cover's really pretty. I think I've seen it in some places. But yeah. So hopefully I'll enjoy that one. Sorry. Keep those in order here. The next one is Before I Die by uh, Jenny Downham. Um, I haven't heard anything about this one. I haven't seen it online or anything. I just like going through the books, the bookshelves at uh, Half Price Books and look at the covers and read the things and see if they look interesting. And this one sounded interesting. It looks like it's kind of got like a maybe a bucket list sort of, and kind of like a Before I uh, Before I Fall. Book, I think, but I haven't read that book, so I don't don't quote me on that. Um, <clears throat> it says I don't know how long can I stay. I don't know. All I know is that I have two choices: stay wrapped in blankets and get on with dying, or get the list back together and get on with living. So it sounds kind of interesting. It looks a little small. So it's 
kind of interesting. A lot of books dealing with dying. Sorry. <laughs> kind of morbid, I guess. Um, <laughs> the next one is As, As You Wish by Jackson Purse. I'm seeing a couple of reviews on it, and it looked interesting. So I was, like, excited when I found when I saw it there. <coughs> so I had to get it. <coughs> Excuse me. So, yeah. Um, I'm sorry. I keep scratching my nose and everything. Uh, the next one I got is book two of the Mortal Instrument series. It's City of Ashes. Um, I have the first book, City of Bones. I'm letting my sister-in-law borrow it. So she's got it, but I haven't read it. So I haven't read any of them. I'm trying to get them all three so that way I can read one after another. And I don't get all. I don't know. You know. You know what I'm talking about. And the next things are not books, but they're <coughs> related book-like kind of stuff. <coughs> Toby, stop. You all know by now that I love bookmarks. So I got some bookmarks when I was at Breast Books. I got this one. It says, the future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of the dreams. Eleanor Roosevelt. So that's that. The next one is this one. It's kind of colorful and all that kind of stuff. <coughs> it just says, imagine, dream, grow, create, become. It says, I imagine, therefore I'm free. Growth contains happiness. It is the spirit that creates. Dreaming is an act of pure imagination. To live is to be slowly born. So it's really cute got a little a lot of little cute quotes and stuff on it so that's awesome I went and bought me a book light because I'm staying with people so I kind of sorry I'm leaving it stop so I'm um about that and then this is really cool I got this at half price books for like ten dollars but it's like a little books a little journal book set thing it's really cool it opens I'm sorry it opens up and it's got like a journal in it see and then it's got like it's got an, I have another book light <laughs> and it's got like a little bookmark some little bookmarks so that's pretty cool but this journal is really neat it's like it says the reading journal on it you can't read it because it's in black but it's got like questions about the books you read and it says favorite author and then it says author uh, the genre, the category, the first book you read by the author, the reason to read more by the author, your favorite paragraph, check out authors who are similar, other books to read by the author, the date read, the title, and it goes on through like this whole thing here. Oh crap, it's got more stuff. That's awesome, I didn't notice that, sorry. It's got like books you own. Wow, it's got little pictures and stuff. and. This is pretty cool. I'm sorry, I'm like amusing myself here. Reviews, books loan and books borrowed. This is awesome. Questions to discuss in a book group. Um, reading record, where you can do your own reviews in the little journal. Is that not awesome or what? Book passages and notes. Hey, that kind of works for me. Seeing as I just use regular paper. <laughs> and then it has little. <laughs> that was Miko. It's got like, little literary terminology. That is too cool. I didn't even notice all that stuff. But yeah. So I got that at Half Price Books for like 10 bucks. I should have totally got that. Got something like this for somebody. But I don't know anybody who likes to read as much as I do. But this is awesome. So yeah. That's all I got. So, um, what did you get in your mailbox?